to the prisoner or whatever. Oh my god, that's a flower shop. Oh, oh, it's not flower. Oh. There's options. We got options. There's options. Yeah, I think this is just frosty. I don't know, but it's really cute. Beck has decided that she wants to film a TikTok Hello. today. Hello. She's gonna try. Here we go. She's Cherry blossom. We're trying to find the spot and we just got lost. This is St. John's house. There's John. We're having such a nightmare. Like we can't find this building anywhere. But Google Maps is telling us something different. Wait, Becca, that looks like it. are quite loud. We're just being very considerate about the people around us because we know as soon as we get some food we're gonna be there like ah! I've got Made chia it. butter with hot mozzarella. Ooh, the song that's stuck in our heads right now is Chiana Taylor's, what's it called? I don't even know what it's called. <laughs> Seven Oaks tomorrow, Canto, which is near London. So that's fun. Look at this sound. <laughs> Look at the beige meal ever. It smells amazing, but it's so beige. <laughs> Chicken nugget, mate. Oh, hilariously, we've ordered the most beige thing ever, like British and that's on us. I'm gonna take off my makeup now. This is the glow recipe. Papaya sorbet enzyme cleansing balm. She smells good. I feel like I've been using it forever and it's not gone down that much. I always feel like as soon as I get inside, I want to take off the makeup. I don't want to have it sitting on my face if I'm not doing anything. Because I can, it's almost like I can feel the. I can almost feel the spots forming, which sounds so gross, but it's literally true. My face isn't used to having like too much makeup on and I don't like it. Like when I do shows, it's the first thing to come on. We're trying to get some music projects done. I've had music sat ready to go for three years and I've just, for different reasons, not been able to put anything out which is very frustrating when, like I know that my first release is probably not gonna be like a viral hit or whatever. So I haven't built up the fan base, which is fine because it's gonna happen over time, but I wanna put out like high, the highest quality songs that I can. It has to be good. It's just been a little bit stressful because unfortunately I got burnt by a couple of producers last year. Very, very annoying, very frustrating. Is what it is, I'm not willing to talk about it today. But what I will say is we've got some new exciting projects around the corner, we being me, and it's in motion. Not there yet. Gonna get into some cozy clothes. Put my jogging bottoms on right now because I cannot chill in jeans anymore. Tell me why I used to wear jeans all of the time. Even after like college, I would just have my jeans on. These are really cute jeans from Zara. They're a wide leg fit and they're just so cozy and amazing. Vintage, well, vintage now because I've had them for years. Comfy. As soon as I took my makeup off, my agent was like, hey, do you want to film a self tape? I'm going to film that later. But that's going to be my evening now. My usual reader for self tapes. He is currently making his West End debut next week. So he's in rehearsals and I can't use him. So I think I might have to use my mum. This has honestly never happened before, but I just did my vocal first song. So we've got an up-tempo and a ballad. So the up-tempo one I just did, and one take wonder. I love it when that happens. 
I'm gonna do the second ballad, which is overdone, but for this production that I am auditioning for, it kind of makes sense for the piece. I'm not gonna say what it is, because I'm not allowed. And this YouTube channel, uh, the audition cut on YouTube, they have audition cards, but they have a silence in between. So when you press play, you can stand. Like they thought of everything. Oh no, please, not the jogging bottoms. You can only see from here upwards. Got some juice in my fancy car. Oh. I'm also filming a vlog at the same time as filming a self tape. It's very two for one. I was in my head and it showed. I was thinking, what are the neighbors gonna do? What are the neighbors gonna think? What are the neighbors saying? What do I care about the neighbors? The neighbors aren't gonna help me get a job. The neighbors aren't putting me on the theaters. The neighbors aren't putting me in the West End. Why do I care about the neighbors? Because I'm, I'm scared that they're gonna be like, oh, shut up. Ready? Good morning, it's 10 a.m. and I'm princessing it up. I've always said that if like when I was growing up, I didn't look like Pocahontas or Princess Jasmine. That's what I was saying to my boyfriend last night. And I was literally wearing my Jasmine outfit and he was like, she doesn't look like Princess Jasmine. She said, embodying the literal character of Jasmine as we speak. I think I look like Moana. If I was going to be a Disney princess, I would be Moana. But she's quite new. Like, I was only seven years old or something like this, like 2016. Yeah, seven years. So, I think I'd be more on that. Anyway, it is good. It is 4 a.m. and I just walked through the door. No. It is now like half three on Sunday and I did get in at four. I didn't go to sleep until about half five, so she had her eight hours in for sleep, but I just haven't eaten anything yet. So we're gonna make some mushroom bagels, some sauteed mushrooms on a bagel with an egg. We're gonna have a little bit of cucumber and hummus and a little bit of apple and peanut butter and honey. Cause it's the chef's combo. I'm currently doing a tour of the UK in an adult pantomime of Aladdin and Princess Jasmine. And at the service stations, I keep seeing these apple slices in m &S with peanut butter sauce. And it's so, it's so good. So we're gonna recreate that. <laughs> My nice little breakfast. <laughs> so, if you work out, five hundred. You could possibly work out what a fifth of that is, couldn't you? Maybe. To be honest, you're not going to be able to get a fire room with it. We can have a bit of it. Hug the um, chocolate. So it's all hug the way Three tablespoons. Some mini eggs. And I have these cute little Easter picks. 